Hello, my name is Mrs. Kyneth. I did get married over the summer. I was Miss Lardy before, so if your child had me, when I was Miss Lardy, it's still me. My name is just Mrs. Kyneth now. I'm a special education teacher here at Seneca High School. I teach math classes and resource classes. To the right, you'll see my schedule of what I teach. First hour in A days, I have a COTA Algebra 1A class with Mr. Holman that is blocked up with a skills development class. However, I only co-teach the algebra class with him. Then second hour, I have a consumer math class. This is for seniors, where we focus on real life skills when it comes to math. So we talk about taxes, we talk about paychecks, we talk about payroll, credit cards, credit reports, so on and so forth. After that, I have Math 2. This is a class with my sophomore students where we focus on the beginning fundamentals of algebra with the hopes that the students can either continue on the path and go to Math 3 or attempt to go in the general education setting for Algebra 1A. After that class, I do have my prep period, which is when I make most of my parent contacts. So if you need to get a hold of me, either of my fourth hour prep periods would be a great time to do that. Then on B days, my first hour is resource, which is an enriched study hall for students to work on their both academic and functional goals while getting support from a teacher and paraprofessionals. After that, I have a combined math class of math one and math three. I do have a paraprofessional with me in this class. So the students are broken up into their different class periods and given separate time for direct instruction and time to enrich their various math skills. After that, I go back and teach another resource period, um, again, where the students have a guided study hall to work on the various goals that are set for them. For all of the classes that I have, there is a Google Classroom. The students are able to log into the Google Classroom and find a bunch of different information that they need to help them be successful as a student in class or as a remote learner. The students can first find the Zoom link um, so that if they're ever at home and they need to log in to either get help from me or log in for class, they will use that same Zoom link anytime that I'm the teacher of that class. They will also find the syllabus on Google Classroom. Furthermore, all assignments will be posted on Google Classroom this year so that students are able to complete the work on their computer. Even if I hand out a worksheet in class, it will also be posted on Google Classroom for the students at home that are remote learning or in case the students in class do lose that worksheet, they can print another one off and get it done. Google Classroom will be my main source of information. The students can get to it by going to googleclassroom.com or by clicking the link in PowerSchool Unified Classroom. Either way, it will get them to the same spot. If you would like to contact me at any point, my email is listed right here, akineth at senecahs.org or you can call my phone at school, which is 815-357-5098. I do tend to answer emails quicker because there are many times in the day when students are in my classroom and I'm not comfortable making phone calls until my classroom is completely cleared out. But if you would like to have a phone call, please expect it to be during either my fourth hour prep or after school hours. It is going to be a unique, unique school year for both the teachers, students, and parents, but I know it's going to be a great one. I look forward to working with all of you this school year.